Are you ready? No, but... <laughs> can you stick a uh, step to your left? And just ignore the camera and you click. Can I have okay. your name and title and position you're running for? I'm sorry, you're gonna have to start over. Uh, can I have your what name? What title? Like what I'm running for? Mm -hmm. But okay. Yeah, and then just the names so we get the spelling and everything. Sure, of right. course. Okay. I'm Rachel D. Minor, and I'm running for District Two Councilwoman. Okay, Ms. Minor, um, can you talk to me about what separates you from the other candidates? What separates me from the other candidates? Um, I think I would bring a a new approach, um, a, a proactive approach to the city government. I think I am an objective thinker and I would see, look at more of the big picture. Um, I don't owe anyone any anything. I'm new to politics just as President Trump was and so I look forward to serving the, the citizens of, of District 2. Where do you think the city can improve? I guess not only in District 2 but just in general. Right. The list is too long on the different <laughs> issues that can be improved. I'm going to focus on government transparency, um, on the infrastructure of Odessa, our water, sewer, roads, communication, that all needs to be, um, and then small businesses. Our sm small businesses are the heartbeat of Odessa, and we need to support them and um, be available uh, as a city to help them prosper. Speaking of small businesses, um, COVID came and just sent everything kind of out of whack. Right. How do you see us moving forward from this? I hope we can move forward. It's going to be a new normal for us. There's some laws been passed down that I don't necessarily agree with. I have a lot of friends who own businesses that have been affected, even if they're essential workers, have been affected. And they're having to make drastic cuts because of the issues that COVID has brought. I do think that it is a very much a real virus. I mean, it has affected many people's lives. Um, I have friends that have passed away from it. I have family members who have recovered from it. I still have um, hope that we can move forward more quickly than we are currently, um, but that's what I believe. Do you have any message for your constituents in the area? Just to vote for Rachel D. Minor for your new councilwoman. I promise to, to listen to you, to your needs and your wants, and to um, diligently seek the answers and to vote for what's best for Odessa. Anything else you'd like to add? No, thank you. Thank you so much for your time. Uh,